Meet the Ethiopian wolf, the rarest wild dog in the world, battling for survival on the African continent dominated by the super predators. How do they survive? With weapons of a wild dog. Combining that with hunting tactics of wild cats. They found a cat. He's really pissed. Makes this wolf a special creature with features all its own. Boom, he goes in. Whoa. This is a story of an underdog under siege, the Ethiopian wolf. We're going to spend a day in the life of the Ethiopian wolf. The sun rises at 6.45 a.m. We had to be at the wolf den ready and waiting because Ethiopian wolves rise with the sun and they don't stick around for long. All right, this is the Pakistan site. Oh, yeah. At the base of this rocky ledge is the den. Who's out, Chris? It looks like the pups. Two pups are out. Two pups are out. Oh, nice moves. Oh, there he goes. Where's he off to? I don't know, but somewhere in a hurry. Up on the rocks, an adult. Oh, here come the pups to greet mom. Yes. All right, the morning greeting. That's a ritual of these dogs. Where's the rest of the pack? They must be here somewhere. Oh, there. A beautiful adult. And right down below, a third adult. He must be the alpha male. The adults sleep out in the open around the den site. Oh, and a pup coming in to greet. Martin, there are three over there. Pups with an older sister. All right, this is our pack. Mom, dad, their one-year-old daughter, and the five pups. So we are with eight of the less than 500 Ethiopian wolves that survive in the entire world. 